Welcome back to this perfume channel. Today we're talking about the new Burberry for her elixir and I'm going to also make a bit of a comparison between the for her intense which has been discontinued and I think this is supposed to be like the same sort of a scent give us the same sort of a vibe because I know that many people absolutely adored this one with me included. Is this a great fragrance or is it just a pass? So let's start with the bottle as always. I love how they made it all pink. It's so fun and totally just represents the vibe of this scent. By the way, let me know if you are a fan of this scent, if you have tested it already in the comments so people watching can also get your opinions as well. With this one, I would say, let's start off uh, the main thing that is really impressive to me about this fragrance. It's super long lasting. I sprayed it at 10 a.m. and I still was able to smell it at like, it was 1 a.m. like the next day. So a really, really long time for the scent. So if you're looking for a really long lasting sweet perfume, I mean this, it really impressed me. The first impression also of the scent to me is very strawberry, very fun, girly, fruity, but in a very pink, non-serious way, I would say. Straight off the bat, you also get this juiciness, which I find really fun, it really smells fun. And what my husband actually said is that he loves the scent, he thinks it's super feminine and I would say like most people would find this scent pleasing, but on further sort of reflection, I would say that this might be a bit too sweet for somebody who loved the intense version or like the eau de parfum version, because this straight off the bat gets into the heavier, more vanilla, denser qualities to it. It does smell like strawberries, but also an extreme dose of creaminess. So like your cookies, strawberries and cream sort of Starbucks uh, frappe drink. This sort of a really sweet sweetness with a bit of this creaminess. I would say this is like whipped cream, marshmallows, creaminess with strawberries on top. The vanilla base is really quite intense in this one and to me slightly bit too much because in the dry down that's pretty much all you can smell like this really intense musky vanilla. If you love it great for you but if you like a bit more of a caramelly saltier vanilla or if you like more syrupy vanillas then this might be not what you expected from the scent but I think it still is very fun and the way this fragrance looks is actually what it smells like to me. So it's very like fits, it's marketing fits everything together so it does not mislead people by what it is. To me what I was expecting because I also have got the intense, I love the intense version because although it's sweet and it's lighter it's got also much more of this like a leathery undertone, a bit more of this moodier vibe, a bit more grown up, a bit more expensive smelling to me. And the vanilla in here is really much more of a light vanilla, less sort of a like powdery, um, really intense vanilla, but more like airy and light bit more natural smelling vanilla. This is like your fun vanilla. This is really intense. This is a kid that ate all the sweets in the world and it's like <laughs> sugar high. This is this scent to me. So it's much more fun, young and like, oh my gosh, we, we're here to, I don't know, paint our nails pink and just go crazy and try all these outfits on. Whereas this one is a bit more like toned down version of it, if that makes sense. Ooh, <laughs> milkshake. What do you think about this one? I like it very much, especially opening. Mm -hmm. It smells... It's so fun. Yeah, that's yes. my favorite as well. Mm -hmm. it's... Oh, it's so fruity. Very fruity, positive, fun, fun fragrance. Yeah, 
I like it. And I really like the sprayer of the Burberry for her. I've got like niche quality sprays, really fine, misty. I just, yeah, really enjoy the sprays on this one. Mm -hmm. The open is actually even better on this one than on mm -hmm. this one. Mm -hmm. But I, I like this fragrance as well. So, mm -hmm. so this is. They're both really, good really nice. Work, yeah. So. I have to be a bit critical because that's what this channel is all about. But overall, I do really like this scent. I think it's great for younger people. I think older people could also pull it off and really like, if you like the vibe of this fragrance, just wear it no matter what anybody tells you. But if I had to just say something, then this one is definitely a younger leaning scent. This one is a bit older, but more mature, but more refined. I still will wear this and really enjoy it, but it is very intense. So for me, like two sprays are maximum, but it's great because it's the longevity is there. So you'll just be able to enjoy the scent a lot. If you love vanilla, like musky vanilla, that is just like an overload of like marshmallowy sugar vibes, then you'll absolutely love this because in the dry down, it's pretty much all there is to this fragrance, which is great if you love that. Let me know what is your favorite version of Burberry for her, because I know that many people are absolutely obsessed with it. And subscribe to this channel if you haven't already, because I've got a huge perfume collection. I'm always looking at new fragrances. So if you want to smell the best, subscribe to this channel and I'll see you in the new video. Bye for now.